and uh, welcome back to Estancia La Pacho. Now I know it's been a while since I've uh, played on this map. Well, actually, it's it's been quite a while since I've put out any videos at all, to be honest. But this year, that is all going to change. Um. Well, as you can see here now, I've just uh, just bought my JCB and I bought the new Cedar because what I did is, well, I sold uh, the little star attractor that you start off with and I sold all the um, sugarcane equipment because I have one sugarcane field and well basically what I'm going to do <coughs> excuse me guys I've, uh, get, I've got a bit of a cold so I hope it doesn't affect the video too much um, but yeah what I'm going to do is um, I'm just going to rent the uh, the sugarcane harvester um, because I don't really plan on planting any more uh, sugarcane after the field has gone because well for the reason is, is it takes too long and yeah it's, it's a little bit expensive so I just decided that I'm going to uh, just well, I'll just rent it basically. <coughs> well, lease it, should I say? Right, so that's filled up, and yeah, so I sold all I sold the uh, all that equipment, and um, I sold the little star attractor because basically it wasn't powerful enough. <coughs> and if you remember from the last uh, video. I plowed these two fields together so what I'm gonna do in this episode um, is uh, well I'm going to seed it um, and I think I will be putting canola down this time because I have uh, another field that I created myself if you remember with uh, uh, and I'll, I think I'm gonna put some so, oh, some soybeans in that one right make sure it's set to the right size I know it's 6 meters but if I set it a couple lower that should be fine yeah and I hope everybody uh, had a great Christmas and great uh, great new year because uh, now the holiday season is over. Right, so that doesn't look right to me. That doesn't look like five meters if that's only six meters. Is this six meters? Um Yeah, and you might notice that there's uh that the image looks a bit different if you saw where i changed it just there oh no it's nine meters ah. okay so if we see what auto set does ah so there we go um yeah eight point 8.7 will do. <clears throat> yeah, if you'll no if you notice the uh, the difference in the quality of the graphics, uh, well, I've found a file. It's called a shade. It's called Shader. Um, and well, basically, it's supposed to make the uh, the the map more realistic. Now, um, let me just start this off and then I can tell you all about it. Uh, lower that. 
Yeah, um... Uh, no, 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 I don't want to tweet. I don't want to tweet. <laughs> I forgot to change it. Uh, yeah, canola. Never mind, it looks like I'll have a little bit of wheat in this bit. Unless it uh, overwrites it, it may do, but... Yes, never mind about that. Yeah, so if you can see on the left hand side of the field there, the grass. Now, that looks uh, looks rather realistic with the, uh, with the shading. If I just jump out of the tractor and show you. Now, it looks really, really nice. And this is with the shader turned on. Now, if I turn the shader off, which you can do by just pressing the scroll lock on the keyboard, now, that's how it would look normally in the game. And I actually think that it, it looks a whole lot better with that. But you can also press uh, the page up which changes the field of uh, field of view. Now, if you can see over at the distance, it looks well. It looks blurry, but really, really close up. It's like it's like a little uh, I like having your own little macro lens when you're using a camera. And I think that's uh, that's good. But I always turn the field of view off because otherwise you can't, it, it makes the uh, the heads up display makes it all blurry and things so you can't see what's going on so I just turn that off I mean it's okay if you play without um, without the heads up display on but uh, I don't yeah so um, I will put a, a pro, I'll put a link down in the description for uh, this shader because, um, well, basically, you can use it on not just farm simulators, you can use it on uh, a lot of different games. And, um, yeah, I, uh, well, if you can see, you can see the, uh, the field there, even the field, the, the next field looks a lot better. But, um, I have tried to do it on uh, various other games without much success, but uh, maybe that's just because I'm doing something wrong, I don't know. That's probably more like it. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I, 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 I like the look of it. And I'd like to talk to you about my channel as well because, um, well, I know I haven't, uh, over the last few months I haven't been doing that much because of uh, other commitments and things. But hopefully in, the, uh, in this coming year things should change. I uh, should have a little bit more spare time. And, well, what I'm considering doing is more videos on different games. Oh, no, no, I don't own that field. I don't want to uh, drive onto your field. Sorry, farmer. <laughs> but yeah, um, I want, I, I, I'm considering doing other, other games, not just farm sim. Um, because there are uh, there are a few games that I haven't played um, uh, for a long time, and there are some new games that are the old, there are the old games, but they're new to me uh, that I've discovered recently. So, um, but I'll, I'd like some feedback from you guys um, because. Well, basically, um, I am either going to continue continue doing the videos, <clears throat> or 
I will uh, I will do them as um, as a live stream instead of uh, instead of the video. Now, don't know if you guys would uh, prefer me to do the live streams or the videos, but uh, if I do do them as live streams, then uh, obviously they won't be as long as my live streams have been in the past because I have done like six seven eight hour live streams in the past but no oh, something like about an, uh, an hour hour and a half something like that um, and it will be uh, around about 8 p.m. UK time um, or would you rather that I just continue doing the videos and uh, put the videos out uh, just at some point during the day now just let me know what you think about that guys and uh, yeah I'll do whatever's best for you guys because I do know that a lot of my viewers don't have time to sit there and watch um, watch a, an hour and a half uh, video so uh, yeah just let me know what you think and we'll take it from there right so uh, well yeah I'm going to be doing this this field today and hopefully if I have time in the video I will also be doing um, the sugarcane harvest so uh, yeah if there's enough time that's what I'll be doing there
now, just on the last strip now. And uh, as you may have seen, I uh, ran out of seed and had to refill. Um, because the thing is, is well, I'm not sure if it's right or not, but to me, since the last update, it seems that the seed actually runs out quicker than it used to before. Now, I don't know if that's just me or, um, or whether that actually is the case. But to me, it's, it seems like it does uh, use the seed quicker than it used to. I mean, like I say, it might not be the case at all. It might just be the me remembering wrong. But I'm sure somebody will be able to shed some light on that. Right, so, uh, I think, uh, that I think I will, I'm not going to do the, uh, sugarcane harvest in this episode, I don't think, because, well, if I, if I do, then it might make the video a little bit too long, and, uh, well, I don't really want the video to be too long. Um, so yeah, just just remember what I was saying guys about the uh, the different games that I might continue playing but, I mean don't worry about um, my normal weekend streams with, uh, that I usually play with the PCSG guys that that will still be happening on Friday Saturday and Sunday so you know uh, what I'm talking about is um, like during the week so I'll, uh, I would like to know what you want me to do during the week I mean I could, um, because at the minute I've got two series on FS going I've got this one and I have um, Sussex Farm now I could do the live streams on both this one and Sussex Farm and maybe a different game or two on different days I mean it, it's all dependent on what you guys want to see really because I mean I have some like city building games that I haven't played in a while um, and uh, well I actually bought a new city um, city building game the other day uh, Cities in Motion well, one and two. I bought one and two. Um, and I've, I've been playing around with them for a couple of hours. I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm not that good at them sort of games. But I, I, I play for the fun. I don't play a game. If, 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 if I'm no good at a game, then I don't just not play it anymore. I try and learn. Because, I mean, I'm... Um, not that good at farm simulator but I just love playing the game so I still continue to play it and make sure I don't block anything else in there so uh, yeah just let me know what you think about that guys and uh, I'll do whatever you guys want me to do because so I have uh, city city skylines as well now I've had that game for a while um, but I have only recently started playing it again I haven't got no room for this tractor now <laughs> put him in there uh, yeah. and actually I was saying about the um, the sugarcane harvest I don't even think the field is actually 100% ready to um, to to uh, harvest yet anyway not too sure to be honest because um, I know it's growing but and it says on the map to remove cr uh, remove the tops but um, I always wait until it says a hundred percent but I think it's on about 90 percent at the minute oh no it is a hundred percent so once uh, in the in the next episode, I think I will do that. And yeah, let me know what you think about this um, 
this shader as well guys because well obviously it you, you can see the quality on the grass there um but there is a few things that i need to point out to you <clears throat> that when you look at the actual map like that or when you open up the menu or anything like that it does look a bit strange if you see what i mean because it because it makes it makes it more transparent so but you can turn it off so you just press that and then you can see uh what's going on there um and it's the same when you're in the shop when you open up the shop that's it with it turned off but when you turn it on it looks like that so it, it, it makes it a bit more difficult to see but i think i i still think it looks okay but obviously when you put the field of view on as well it might let's see what i mean about how it makes it blurry on certain areas see in the center here it's it's pretty clear but up up at the top and around the sides it starts getting really blurry and that's why that's why i turn off the uh the field of view but yes guys just let me know what you think about that do you think i should carry on using it or um does it make the the video look really poor i mean because obviously if the quality of the video is poor i mean it, then i will not use it because it's it looks okay to me in the game as i'm playing but the important thing is what it looks like to you guys when you're actually viewing it and see when you look at the sky that's it with it turned on and that's it with it, that's it with it turned off so you can see the contrast in the sky and you, the actual tree stands out more which i think is really really good but i will put a, a link down in the description for this uh, this program well it's not actually a program it's just a little file that you have to put into your um into your uh, fs folder into the main game folder and there are there are instructions uh on how to do it in the uh there's a little readme um in in there if uh, you need to do that but like i say i mean i've had uh, a bit of a problem getting it done with uh on other games it doesn't seem to work well i say it doesn't seem to work it's not noticeably working so when i try to turn it on and off it doesn't make any difference in the in the quality of the image so i don't know if it's working on other games but there is on the website there is a list of the games that it actually works with um and any of the games that it's got issues with uh there are some games um i think it said um call of duty warfare i think that was one of the games that it said that it uh, there's major issues with that where it causes crashes and things like that so yeah that's not going to be very good to play at that <laughs> but um yeah just let me know what you think guys and uh i'll take everything you tell me under advisement and i'm gonna leave that there now so i want to thank everybody for watching and uh I want to wish you all a happy new year because this is actually my first video from uh, that I've put up in 2018 so um, but don't forget there's going to be more to come so if you like what you see don't forget to give it a big thumbs up because uh, it helps me more than you know and if you haven't already please consider subscribing to the channel and uh, don't forget to press the notification bell so you know when I publish another video. And until then, I will see you all again very, very soon. So, bye bye for now.